Division rules for 1 and 0. Rule number 1. Any number divided by 1 equals that number. Let's say we have three goldfish. We want to put the fish into one bowl. Three represents the number of fish. One represents the number of bowls. So if we divide three into one group, we get the number of fish in each bowl. We have three fish in each bowl. Rule number one. Any number divided by one equals that number. Rule number two. Any number except zero divided by itself equals one. Let's say we have three fish and we want to put them into three different bowls. The first three represents how many fish we have. The second three represents the number of bowls. Three divided by three gives us the number of fish in each bowl. We have one fish in each bowl, so three divided by three equals one. The second rule says, any number except zero divided by itself equals one. Rule number three, zero divided by any number except zero equals zero. Let's say we have zero fish and three bowls. Zero represents the number of fish. 3 represents the number of bowls. 0 divided by 3 gives us the number of fish in each bowl. We had 0 fish and we tried to split them up into 3 different bowls. Because we had 0 fish to begin with, we have 0 fish in each bowl. So 0 divided by 3 equals 0. The third rule states, that zero divided by any number except zero equals zero. Our last rule says that you cannot divide by zero. Let's say we have three fish and zero bowls. Three represents the number of fish. Zero represents the number of bowls. We can't divide by zero because we cannot put fish into tanks that don't exist. So you can't divide three by zero. Just remember, you cannot divide by zero. If you thought this video was helpful, please leave a like. For more videos like this, please subscribe.